in the not too distant future next sunday ad there was a guy named joel not too different from you or me he worked at gizmonic institute just another face in a red jumpsuit he did a good job cleaning up the place but his bosses didn't like him so they shot him in the space God bless Joel and Gypsy. And all the aliens that have visited the ship. Hi, everybody. Welcome to the Satellite of Love. When you've got a job like ours, you have to believe in a higher power. 30 seconds to commercial sign. And God bless Data and his really cool robot named Lol. And R2-D2 and all the extras in Westworld. And RoboCop, even though I thought he got a raw deal, but it's really none of my business. Oh, and all those early versions that were just there for comic relief. And uh, Ed-209, though I don't know why they'd make a robot that can't walk downstairs. Uh, and God bless Cherry-3000. Oh, yeah, and God bless Galaxina. Okay, and who else? Oh, Do we have to? I don't want to, I'm not. Yeah, you have to. Okay. God bless Tweaky. Commercial sign in five, four, three, two. Commercial sign now. Amen. Come on, we have to pray for them. If we can pray for them, we can pray for anybody. I don't want to pray for the mad scientists. Yeah, Joel, why do we have to pray for them? Well, I think they're watching and they control my oxygen. We don't want you to pray for us. We want you to pray to us. Isn't that right, Frank? Don't look at me! I said never look at me! Mommy! Mommy! Frank, ah. Calm down. It's time for the invention exchange again, Joel, and we'll go first because we've got a party to go to later. Well, this summer's fashions cry out with jubilant two-inch armor plating, saucy turrets, and shells aplenty. You can really clear the beaches this summer with our new tank tops. That's right. The best beach party ever was the one at Normandy. Beach blanket bingo is now beach blanket bombing with the latest in fashion artillery. That's right. Shelling on the beach takes on a whole new meaning. Let's get in position, Frank. Ready, aim, fire. Now let's see how we've done. Hey, wait a minute. I can hear the war. Oh, knock that off. Oh, now don't look at look here. At look, there's still a little red. I'm sorry, I can't give you the bear. Well, what do you think, Joe? Boy, we sure think differently, yeah. thank goodness, you know. You know, you guys took something fun and made it evil, whereas I took something evil and I'm making it fun. Check it out, it's the tickle bazooka, all right? Wow. It's for those times when just a normal tickle isn't ah. enough. Ah. I based it on the premise of what the pundits, Fireside Theater once spoke. Fighting's out of style, fun's where the fear is. Yeah. See, it's got a uh, feather bayonet for hand-to-hand -hand tickling. <laughs> okay, 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 okay. <laughs> okay. And then if you really want to have some big blast of ballistic hilarity, there's the mirth mortar. Let me show you. Uh oh. Uh, Where's okay. yourself? Head for cover. Smile. <laughs> <laughs> what do you think? <laughs> that is so neat. We could base a whole party around that. We could all get in our fuzzy feety pajamas and jump up and down on the bed. <laughs> Look, the only party we're going to is the one where we dance on your grave. Oh, will I be invited? You'll be the guest of honor. <laughs> now, tell them about the movie. I gotta get out of this thing. I'm chafing like a bear. Well, Joel, this week's movie is called Catalina Caper. 
and it is delightful. It's a veritable feel-good movie, a light-hearted romp, a triumph of the human spirit. Thank you, Tommy Kirk, for making us laugh about love again. And it's got a great theme song. You're going to love it. Never, ever, ever see <laughs> Oh, fun. We have fun. Huh. Great. What, what gives? Mm -hmm. Hmm. Huh. Hmm. Hmm. Interesting. What's wrong with this, this guy's a... feet? He has prehensile toes. What do you suppose frogmen's legs taste like? <laughs> uh, like San Diego chicken legs, probably. <laughs> So, uh, what's in the can? I think it's uh, dehydrated water. Oh. oh, a scuba film. Hmm, Jacques Cousteau meets the Pink Panther. By this time, my... Hey, come on. Huh? Oh, yeah. So what's a Catalina caper? Uh, it's one of those little balls you find when you're eating peel and eat shrimp. Mm. Sorry, Charlie, only the best titles are picked. Starring Tommy Kirk, why must Spock die? Oh, Robert Donner. I went to his party. <laughs> Gee, I wonder what she's harping on about. <laughs> hey, who's this guy? Jim Beggs, Sue Casey, Lyle Wagner, Mike Bludgeon. Nice measurements. 36, 2, 85. <laughs> I think that fish is gonna spit up again. Who's afraid of Vanita Wolf anyway? <laughs> Charlie, they cut off my thumbs. Special guest star Peter Mamakos. Oh, Little Richard. I've heard of him. He's not as famous as Peter Mamakos. <laughs> oh, he's playing a trick on that fish. Oh, yeah, feel good about kicking a fish's butt. That's real nice. Hmm. Screenplay written in crayon. What's Clydeware? Hmm. Sal Mungio, Rebel Without a Gauze. <laughs> Bowling to show, doesn't it? Yeah. Here's something you really like. Shalom! <laughs> Look out! <laughs> wow, that is really good animation. Now I'll set fire to the Walt Whitman books, then I'll burn the pile of ketchup in the rise. Come on, you ho-daddies, let's burn some books. yee -hoo. Burn the witch, burn the witch. We shall cleanse the earth with fire. Well, these clan meetings have really lightened up. Look at that. Now that's what I call art. Scantily clad women and a Huey Lewis news sound on the radio. This is the kind of padding I like to see in a film. Throw another beach boy on the fire. Whoa. And so the white Aryan youth dance around the funeral pyre. You know, this is really good sound, and it was before Dolby. Uh, Dolby Gillis? <laughs> I don't know. Meanwhile, in the dark and penetrable void, John Paul Sartre was a moving and a grooving. No exit, baby. Oh, looks like they're uh, in the night gallery. This portrait, a man who smokes more than Edward R. Murrow or Lillian Hellman. I'm William Conrad for First Alert. When you're heading down to the refrigerator and the power goes out... <laughs> hey, it's Steve Higgins. Oh, you mean the star of the Higgins Boys and Gruber yeah. is seen on the comedy channel? Yeah. Wow. This must be Tommy Kirk's Oscar. He's so good that they, they gave it to him before they started the film. He huh. beat out Troy Donahue and Frankie Avalon. Huh? 
Hey, I beat out Dom DeLuise and James Coco for this role, now beat it. He's looking for that string quartet. An original Red Skelton, that's incredibly valuable. Good night, may God bless. This painting is blue, don't work blue in such a way. I'm gonna put this in a frame that fits. Gee, it looks like a garage rag. Sin security. I'm the one who cracked that crime at One Potato too. I beat out Al Molinaro and Jesse White for this role. Oh, that's a family circus. Looks, From Hank looks, Ketchum's Bill Keen collection. Looks kind of like a Reuben. What, Paul Reuben? Any Pee Herman? No. <laughs> Oops, he broke Tommy's Oscar. Oh. Well, I did the same thing to his Pulitzer. Huh? Hmm? What? Hmm? Oh, he's putting it together. Oh, relax. They'll just think it's a Rothko now, see? Yeah, just, yeah, Mondrian, just... perhaps. Boy, that's a big whistle. You know how to whistle, don't you? You just put your lips together and cut to the boat. <laughs> Bangkok, Oriental City. Hoi on Scott's life out of balance. You know, this film is a fantasy because you generally don't see cabs in Southern California like this. <laughs> America's fastidious and well-groomed youth living a clean lifestyle, pumping their clean, hard-won dollars into a clean economy that is sunny, colorful Catalina. Hmm. Are you really? Oh, look at this. White people voted the best people in the world. Young white male still on top. NEA denies Bill Keen Grant. Oh, it looks like Brutus and Popeye after Slim Fast. I'll have standing right behind them. Hmm. Not bad. What's that supposed to mean? I'm going on board, Bob. I know. I can okay, see it sir. in your eyes. Mother! Charlie Baby's come back to the nest. Welcome home, delinquent. Oh, thanks, but we're felons now. <laughs> Hi, I'm Bob Draper. Who must have assigned you as keeper? Don Pringle. <laughs> Heir Down to the potato the chip rest. fortune. Never seen the big water before. I figured a summer on the island for a little juice in the old battery. <laughs> I think you'll like it if you can take him. Well, I did. You should have seen him coming up the coast. I don't think they sell bikinis in Arizona. <laughs> well, they sell them. But I never saw so many trying to cover so much with so little success. <laughs> Thank you, Winston <laughs> Churchill. I felt the same way myself. It only gets better. Say. Talk about mm. the mm -hmm. Have you seen the new crop? And my I corn mean. is as high as an elephant's decisions, eye. Decisions. I've seen three exactly my type. Yeah, real dog. Look, somebody stole another There's painting. Final boarding whistle. Yeah, we'll dig you later. I'll be around and only to keep you guys out of trouble. <laughs> I love this good-natured ribbing. <laughs> <laughs> well, what do you suppose this guy's up to? Mm -hmm. oh. oh. I don't believe it. You saw Big Jake. <laughs> Here, let me help you up with that. Say, that gangplank really gave you what for, friend. <laughs> <laughs> he should okay. wear a truss. Cue the made-for-TV music. Whoa. Exciting and new. <laughs> yeah. Smell that air, huh? Take a look around. Mm. Air, water. Air, water. You're pretty observant there, pal. Provided far more exhilarating diversion below deck. I didn't know you were holding my compadre. I made a mistake. Maybe you're not ready. I'm ready, I'm ready. I think the forum will be good for me. I plan the agenda. In Phoenix, you showed me all the ugly glories of Gila monsters and cactus and pants. On Catalina, believe it, man, I am team. Surfing. Girl. Big game fishing. Girl. Scuba diving. God. Girl. He sounds like Kirk Gowdy, doesn't he? Or Hugh Hefner. <laughs> In your capable and All right, and we start the summer with a bang. Like we start right now, below deck. You mean deck? Well, breathe huh? a little. Huh? I've been driving all night. Breathe, live. If Mohammed won't come to the mountain. Yeah. <laughs> well, I think that's inappropriate social behavior. Excuse me, I gotta go invent the walk now. After this. So I want to join the forum. Hey. Hmm. Nice railing. 
May I retie your pants? It was quiet out here. It was quiet. What an idiot. I've never seen the ocean before. Well, then you've missed much. Yes, that's only 75% of the Earth's surface. Yes, I have. There is a whole world in this world, and there is life. All sizes, shapes, and colors. Mm -hmm. huh? Sure could get hung up on it tomorrow night on the beach. Yes, I'm well, hung up on it right now. Help in me. I dove into the sea and began swimming underwater. And there was this small fish. She's beautiful. He wasn't Joel. afraid of me at all. Hey, was she in the movie we David and Lisa? I think she's pretty. Fishing boat ahead frightened. And I never saw my little friend again. Hmm. You know, there's a psychiatrist on board. I think he could really help you. For the weekend, perhaps longer. Why? Great. Because would you like to go swimming with me? With me and Edie Sedgwick and Rod LaRod? Oh, that would be wonderful, but I'm afraid that... Don, baby. Go get him. Say. Hey, we're done with the forum. We're druids now. I'm the truth. I can't help whatever it is I do to him. Come on, let's go. Oh, I'd like to make their scene, but they're a little weird and... Hey, fishy, fishy, fishy. Come here, little fishy, hey, fishy. let's dig Little Richard really turn it on. Little Richard? I hate impressionists. Oh, you're thinking of Rich Little. Oh. Now pay attention, you guys. This scene is obviously really important to the film. This is Little baby, Richard. Baby, baby, uh -oh. come along with me. Dig this. Prince, I hope you're watching this. Hey, we have a chair downstairs with that upholstery. Uh, it looks like a coffin lining. Hey, get the funk out of my face. Come on. Dig it. Well, there's uh, really nothing we can say about that, is there? It's not during family hour. Hey, look, it's Alan Seuss. Oh. <laughs> Oops. Let's get seasick. Hmm. I think I know a bright young singer that's popped up on goofballs right now. Is he yes, in this scene? Yes. And his head's about ten feet tall. Hmm. I like the pencil thin mustard. Okay. Hey, oh, that's his band. Great. Next we'll see Sly Stone with the uh, Up With People problem. I turn it with the cow sills. It'll all be in casts. James Brown and the Starland vocal band. Maybe? Yeah, George Clinton with the Ray Conniff singers. <laughs> like this, Mr. Richard? How's this, huh? Is there a history of epilepsy in your family, boy? You know, he's so hopped up. Uh, I think he's thinking he's at the Apollo or something. I like him. Hey, it's Ron Howard's brother. Ben. 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 Hey, whoa. Looks like Cousin It with a bob. A swinging bob. Mm -hmm. Little Richard, the only genuine talent in this film. You know, those dancers are standing on dumpsters. Would that make them white trash? Um, I'm glad we recycle. The Nazi party! Everybody! You know, I'm feeling like we were at the party. dance thing and laughing, kind of. Oh, well, you were great. Now leave. Out the back door. Well, it's just us, Timmy. When you graduate from Pat Boone University. So Falco leaves the Calypso. And another painting is stolen. Oh, is this where they filmed the boat next? That looks really familiar. Now, local news. Police investigation failed to turn up new clues. And My skull is an amplifier. Of the priceless Chu Dynasty scroll from a private Los Angeles museum. Yeah, That's I did it. I did it. I'm proud, man. But police remain stumped at this point. The search uh, continues. Hey, you got puke on my radio. Oh, you got radio on my puke. <laughs> Actually, I think he's uh, working on a new script. He must be the screenwriter. Yeah. Right. Okay. Oh, magic balcony, take me away from this kooky crowd. 
I'm the white guy who runs this ship. I could take out this whole crowd if I wanted to. I'm that powerful. Disperse. It's time to vacuum the pool, I think. Hey, you got room for one more extra? Wait for me. <laughs> no, they've got a fat, dumpy guy in this already. Oh, sorry. They're diving for chum. <laughs> got it! Got it! Got it, got it now! Jump him up. Petticoat hey. Junction. <laughs> What gives? He's the guy with the implant. Uh, Carol? Uh, Carol? Uh, Carol? Hey, Carol? Harvey? Carol? How's your little fish? We have a proper love. I got your stick, Mr. Luthor. Uh -oh. oh. Would you give me that? Sorry. Man, I'm too tired to even do one of my famous craft balls. I'm, I'm all hurting and hot and hurt and stuff. Well, now, guys, just sit right back and you'll hear a tale. <laughs> Crete, ancient civilization. Mykonos, modern civilization. Uh. Hmm. Mel Brooks, Anne Bancroft, and Tom DeLuise in Boat Nicks 2. Oh, shut, shut up. up. Lawrence, you're, we're really proud of you. You're a credit to your profession. Village idiot. <laughs> I do the best I can with what I've got. Which isn't a whole hell of a lot. Let's go downstairs and I'll show. Mm. Uh, Tad is below. I'm afraid our son wouldn't approve of our Your son? What is this? Who's afraid of Virginia Woolf? <laughs> I know what you mean. It's not your son, you George. just can't trust a kid who don't follow baseball. Or trust a guy with a dumb a Crayola chair. hat. Yeah. Hey, it's filled with M&Ms. Mm. Neat. Long ones. Well, let's see here. You are a child of the universe, no less than the trees in the... What's Desiderata? What do you think, Ed? It's a Howard Johnson placemat. I don't think you won the riddle contest. Well, with the equipment we had below, it shouldn't take long. Say. I should have the duplicate finished in less than 24 hours. She's something. We're a great little team. Oh, shut up. Yeah, not enough for an infield, but it's the William Burroughs figurehead. Even they make me sick. Hey, why two? Hmm. One for the genuine, one for the duplicate. One for the little girl who lives down the lane. Jodie Foster? Yeah. Boy, now we know the everything. entire plot. Thanks a lot. Hey, have you contacted our fat Greek pigeon yet? Hmm? Friend Lakopoulos arrived he's last night. He's the Topolis. You know, I hear he's got a whole castle filled with stolen art treasures stashed away in Switzerland. Nerds Popolis. How come a millionaire like Dino Lakopoulos wants to be a crook? Because he's in Scropolis. One needs a profession to procure one's taste, Lawrence. Oh, I see. First, we like show him the picture. Oh. He okays it, right? Right. Right. Mm -hmm. Then we slip in the phony scroll that you're going to paint tonight. Mm -hmm. Then Donald goes in where the others have been. been. Then you'll return the original to its rightful owner. Uh -huh. And then return that now shirt that to Robin Williams. Yep. I mean, how come we can't keep it? We certainly can't keep it. That would be dishonest. No. Well, the deal we're pulling on Lacopolis ain't exactly kosher. Oh, no, the mail. Uh, not quite the same. Lacopolis is a proud thief. That's the only way he'll do business. It's expected one will try to cheat him. Like Nixon. Arthur, you've outdone yourself this time. Why, well, you're simply glowing with him. That sweat. Ah, oh, dear, I'm really very proud of you. Thank you, dearest. I must admit, I do have a flair for this sort of thing. Alcoholism? True, true. <laughs> Betty won't fall. Oh. Well, well, we better beat it, guys. Oh. Joel, could you tell us about this thing called the 60s? Yeah, I'm amused and fascinated by such an environment that the beautiful, creepy girl existed in. Well, I was just a little kid when it happened, but I could tell you guys what I remember. Okay. Well, yeah, you're so much older than you're younger than that now. 
Yeah, yeah whatever, ah. Crow. Anyway, Kamba, could you run that music? Yeah, cool, hey. okay. Well, it was a lot simpler time back then, you know? Like, I'll give you an example. Like, it wasn't uncommon at all for your mom to come and serve you a great big charbroiled steak while she smoked and uh, drank a tab and made a, your dad another Manhattan for the road, and that was just breakfast. Oh, go on. Yeah, there were seat belts in cars, but Sucks. nobody used them. Pre-sweetened cereal, subliminal messages. Drugs. People smoked openly on The Tonight Show. Hey, uh, tell us about the Rat Pack again. Oh, okay. Well, as you know, uh, Frank Sinatra was chairman of the board, Drop and everybody box. else filed on in line, except for Jerry Lewis. He had had a falling out with Dean Martin, Turn and uh, they already had chosen Joey Bishop to be their comic relief already, so he was kind of out of luck. But Dean was tall and tan and quick with a song, and he just had to say the word, and Sex. cuckoo chicks would file on up to the hospitality suite and massage Peter Lawford's neck and make everybody groovy drinks Austin's. while they took important phone calls from places like Palm Springs and um, the White House until Ooh, turn me it on was time man. for Frank Sinatra, the chairman of the board, to come Ooh. out of the sauna and he'd say the words and the dollies would go take a nap. Uh, no messages. Oh, uh, t tell us about the rabbits, Joel. Yeah, that's the rabbits. a good one. Okay. Meanwhile, in the Windy City, um, Hugh Hefner was cooking up his own groovy scene in the aptly yeah. named Playboy Mansion. Oh, wow. Okay, there was George Kennedy and George Hamilton and Tony Curtis and Bill Bixby were all huh? in his court. Sophisticated men who knew their racket. I think you're swinging swingers. into oh. high. Yeah. Yeah, anyway, there was um, like Twiggy and Abby and Peter, Paul and Mary, Dion, Donovan, uh, uh, Melanie, uh, uh, Abraham, Martin, and John. And so you know? they just went by their first names like that? Yeah, like you, Crow. Hey. And there were typewriters, but nobody used them. And women were called girls. Wow. And businessmen wore double-breasted suits, had double chins, drank double bourbon, straight no cool. chaser. Before, during, and after Come important ass. business meetings Bring and uh, summit talks, everybody I'm believed what the president said. Why shouldn't they? Sitting. Sexually provocative off. humor wasn't on TV. It was on cocktail napkins, and Toys. we liked it that way. Toys had metal edges and little uh, pieces that were breakable and would fit into your mouth. They would take no and make ice. a playground equipment out of stainless steel, then haul it up on the asphalt where you could get hurt. Parents were actually told to spank their kids. Well, my mom Austin actually Stolson. made me go and get the uh, belt, you know, in front of Joel, company, and that was really Joel, frustrating Joel, because Joel, once they made me Joel, take a bath Joel. in the front yard. Why can't you be like everyone else and just remember the good things about the 60s? Yeah, like Woodstock. Oh, the Woodstock, great. Okay, no, Joel, you can't go to Woodstock. You're nine years old. We're going to the opening of the new Century Store. Oh, yeah, on Echo Lane. Three days of peace, love, and pizza rolls. We're going to uh, buy you a shopping people, cart Joel's for your in birthday, a lot of pain. Joel. Oh, boy, we'll be Peter right from Axe moved freely among men. They were, t oh, did I mention there were drugs at that time? Yeah. And then... Yeah, and the only shoes they had were PF Flyers and Keds, and that Joel. was it. Nothing, no pumps, okay. no nothing. Okay, okay, Joel, okay, oh, you yeah. can cool it now. You okay? Hey, look at the prow on that steamer. <laughs> Let's climb aboard. Whoa. Oh, boy, Mitty. Hello, Betty. Yeah, that's one of my chicks. Turn to what? The Comedy Channel. <laughs> Little promo there, gang. Yeah. <laughs> Hello. Hi, Hello. 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 Shall we have breakfast at the club, dear? That would be nice. I wet myself. <laughs> Ooh. Thank goodness this briefcase is a personal flotation device. I love that trombone. Welcome to White Island, acting like we deserve this kind of lifestyle. Only the best looking girls get to be starfish. Chuck, it's great to have you home. Hey, it's great to see you. What, what's your name? Hi, wanna trade hair? <laughs> sure made the scene out there. It's all your fault. You weren't supposed to be here until tomorrow. We finished our exams and split a day early. Hey, Where how are things in the oh, fatherland? Yeah, I hung up on the mainland for a couple days. Yeah, Mom got hung up on the tennis pro at the club. This must be Don Pringle. You named it right, Miss Bunny. I understand Hi. your ruffles Welcome have ridges. Welcome to Catalina. <laughs> Chuck mentioned you were coming in his last letter. 
We'll try to make your summer as eventful as possible. Oh, wow. Well, I'm prepared to defend myself against anything you might have said about me, if I have to. He said you were a jerk. Something tells me apologies are in order, Miss Bunny. Miss oh. Bunny. Now, Mikhail, what the hell are you doing? That guy looks like uh, Ralph on Green Acres, doesn't he? Are you folks all right? Oh, yes, sure, we're fine, fine, all except my assistant. He's a little wet. I left him on board. I'm awfully sorry. That was pretty stupid of me. Oh, think nothing of it, young lady. Those you things are do happen. I'm Arthur Duval. This is my wife, Anne, our son, Tad. Charlie Mott. My sister, Tina, and this Tad is Don Tad Tom. 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 Isn't that the Sloan's yacht you're using? Uh, yes, matter of fact, it is. Oh, the Sloan's. We met the Sloan's in Monte Carlo last season. Charming people. When they lie learned about so our plans gracefully. to spend the summer here at Catalina, they insisted that we have the use of their yacht. Yeah. Is this your first trip here? Well, yes, we haven't had much opportunity to visit your little uh, treasure island. <laughs> However, we are interested in learning all there is to know about treasure, aren't we, Ann? Oh, <laughs> 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 Hey, I just became a Mormon. I'm with you, Miss Bunny. Dad, why don't you come along? We're going to split with the boat for some scuba diving. Oh, but of course. Oh, that's a very kind invitation. Tad's been cooped up aboard ship since we arrived. Tied to a man. Give you a chance to enjoy yourself, son. Meet some people your own age, like Miss Bunny here. Get away from your infeminate father. Live a little. No thanks. Next time around. Not nearly enough beautiful women for me. Dad, could I see you for a minute? Certainly, son. Excuse me, dear. I'm going up to the hotel to give another sun hat. You know, Dad, what is it, Mom's Dad? really hot. Dad, why did we come to Catalina? Came to enjoy ourselves. Why? Whenever you and Mother come to enjoy yourselves, it means you're involved in some kind of a shady deal. Well, I know you've been hanging around with that Dave Delgado guy. To the quick. I'm glad your mother isn't here to listen. When you talk like that, I know you're up to no good. And when you smell like that, what somebody kind must die. What shady deal could we possibly be involved in on a small island like this? I don't know, yes. but whatever it is, you and Mother are right smack in the middle of it. Ted, I give you my word. Your mm. mother and I are here on a holiday, and for no other reason. Yeah. Now, I'm starved. Let's get something to eat. Yeah, and when you give that take to the camera, what do you expect? Oh, my Dad, I love him so. Uh-oh, hold it, you guys. <laughs> this is going to be funny. Yeah. Now, just let yeah. it play out. I want to get all the great humor in it. Get ready to laugh. Great physical comedian. Time. Heck of a walk from the mainland. And and then it gets funny, right? Mm. Uh. Oh, well. Uh, maybe not. Is that the funny part, Phil? I guess. This is a place. Okay, Miss Bunny, cross the anchor. I already did. Wow. Oh, we need a new shower curtain. Much the imagination. I don't have one. Ever do any diving, Don? Oh, well, yeah. The university. <laughs> Not quite. Thanks. There's a trick to it. Just remember one thing. You'll be underwater. You breathe normally, but through your mouth, not your nose. Bottoms up. He's always saying that. We don't know why. Hey, it looks like a gas. You'd better use the ladder. Oxygen. I'm on the diving team, remember? Congratulations. Now I'll use the ladder. <laughs> but I said I was on the diving team. It's the Pueblo. So I just key. Hmm, very interesting. But stupid. What is it, Mr. Lacopolis? Let me have a look. Don't get excited, Foreman. Too young for you. That isn't fair. You keep your mind on the Say. business. I'll take care of everything else. An exchange I student. I contacted Duval. Now, he Barbara, buff you. my head. Unfortunately, Duval is a thief. A clever one. Remember that. You must trust no one and be very careful. And Please remember something else, too. An object in so motion tends to stay in motion Why unless acted upon by an unbalanced force. Now get out. Doesn't sound very Greek, boy, does he? And a very stupid one. You, the purported art expert, I can replace. Okay, Daddy you Warbucks. This, friend Borman. I promise you a long walk home. Then I'll kill you again. Should I go put the horse's head in my bed again? Hi, Kaiser Wilhelm, you kooky monarch. <laughs> Metropolis is still out there. Hmm. Yeah. Is that your hand? You know, I'd give a month's pay to know why he's got such a sudden interest in California wine. Five waters. bucks? Sure must be nice. Have all that bread. Cruise Post. around the world on your own yacht. Eat all the yeah, fruit, throw away the rind. He'll die in the ocean, Doesn't and when he does, those vultures at work for him will pick his little world clean. Hmm. Nice analogy. I know I hired you for something, Rod McEwen. Let's break Take for a chat. watch for a while. I'll see you later.
They are a couple of salty tars. Arr. What'll I do now? Put on your face mask. Hold on your mm -hmm. what? Can you breathe all right? Good now, duck under and swim around. Just stay close to the surface. Wow, this is the weirdest Lamaze class I've ever seen. <laughs> it's all blue you and okay, sweat and stuff. Are you okay, or do you want to cough out while you're still ahead? My nose does. It won't stop breathing. Let's try it again. Take a couple of deep breaths through your mouth. Uh, oh, that's this thing, right? The sweat in my face? Yeah. But not up this time in two minutes. Fake it without me. Ready Take to it. give it a try? Mm -hmm. I'm with you. Hang on to my waist. Anything you say, teacher. Down, hey, hey. You've got the wrong sport. When does it become the right sport? When ESPN merges Talk with the Playboy that, channel. Now get underwater. Face, remember, breathe through your mouth. Not through your hands. This time, my lo I'm sorry. So I, that was me. I'm sorry. Need some Jacques Cousteau jokes instead, will you? What was happened when I turned off the air? Say, I hear Ivan Tuller is casting a new adventure show in the Keys with a dolphin. What happens if I feel the volume? Don't pay the full price. Get the trip. Trying to impress some people. Then I'll go out and start a line of clothes called Polo. Oh, I look like Phil Harris, well, I don't know I? This Borman guy. He'll he will cast us in Excalibur. All gotta know about, about killing and things like that. Oh, oh, he's got it up here. Do you know that he knows the batting average of every white stocking player of the 1876 season? Oh, shut, shut up. up. Somebody out to check the painting, but in broad daylight and, and so soon. Oh, boy. I should have stayed in real estate. Yeah. Oh, that's my watch. It does that every quarter hour. Cast off. Hmm? Cast oh, off. Yeah. Oh, it hurts when I think. Cast Let's off see. the line, idiot. Oh, the line, yeah, right. Uh, the rabbit goes around the hole, and then it comes out the other, but it, oh. Uh, Meanwhile, on Bruce Wayne's stately yatched. Yacht, pardon me. Hey, there's a boat out there. You think that's him? No, that's us, you fool. It. It's an exterior it's shot. Anything. If you ask me, we're sticking our necks way out playing ball in his park. You don't even have a How neck. How come we gotta show the real stroll to Lacopolis, man? One thing you must learn, Lawrence, is that you show the genuine item to bait the hook. Proving to the buyer that you have it is one of the distasteful but necessary things about this business. Tell me when you're done. Maybe he won't show up anyway. Borman specified the cove away from the harbor for the rendezvous. I doubt that he'll miss it. Now get away from me, little man. Patience, Lawrence. One other thing that you must learn. Now drop anchor. Oh, there's that watch of mine again. Where? When you get out of here. Okay, all right. <laughs> oh, Remember great. that last time? We were uh -huh. a little disappointed. Yeah. I think now we're going to see a scene that's ripe with comic possibilities, all right? The real mechanics of comedy. Tragedy tomorrow, comedy, comedy tonight. tonight. Yeah. The Jacques Tetti of the boating world. Yep. I'm ready. Sir Hulot in Catalina. You know it's gonna be funny. He's wearing corduroy. Right, gonna get doused. This is this is uh, the funny oh. right here. Oh, he's gonna catch his foot in the rope, right? Oh no! Number twenty-seven, the old boat and the anchor trick. Uh, oh, but where's the funny? Oh! Hey. oh. <laughs> Didn't come out of his tuck in time. Russian judge gives him a three. Oh, that wasn't funny at all. That was kind of stupid, actually. Well, I, I'm the bad guy. Remember me? Hmm? Andy Graham. Uh, I sir. am death. Have you ever read our watchtower? On time, eh, gentlemen? <laughs> Where's the scroll? Did What's you bring wrong? the money? Mr. Lacopolis is not a stupid man. Sure, he drools and sings camp songs. But... Arrange a fair exchange. Gee, it's hard to take him seriously oh, in that see. suit. Yeah. Uh, you're soaking in it. <laughs> so, you uh, swim around here much? Were you a little hard on the fat guy? Yeah. Hmm, uh, don't you have a line? Oh, ah, uh, here he is. <laughs> Look, the water fuzz! Hmm? Water fuzz? Yet some call them water pig. Oh, no, you don't do that. 
Oh, yes, I do. Oh, 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 Please, love me. Oh. Huh? What? Spinner, Paddlefoot, quick, clutch it in trouble. How did you like it down there? Mm. Once they get the hang of it, I may give up the desert and rattlesnake for life. Yeah. Water fuzz, they're wet, they care. Tonight's episode, Death Ahoy. Yo ho ho and a bottle of death. Tinker Taylor, soldier, dead man. Michael Roll, your murder ashore. <laughs> Hallelujah. No, Timmy, no, no, darn fool, kid. Skippy's in trouble. Uh, you just ate. Be careful down there. there. Hmm. Huh. Well, they're gone. Oh. Let's form a girl group. Three. Oh, looks like somebody swabbed the deck with somebody's butt. <laughs> Long about that time, the old Duke boys got a little trouble coming their way. In the form of Mr. Skinman. Huh? It is cold. Oh, I just... Hi. Uh -oh. Greetings. I come from the... Hello? Come on, come on, get out here, baby. Look at the colors, the colors. Look at the colors. Must get back to right lowest five. This must be wet side story. <laughs> Join me in my dance on the dust. <laughs> yes, it's synchronized swimming on ESPN. The wet network. <laughs> I'm coming, baby boy! <laughs> I'm going to give you such a water wedgie you're not going to ever forget. An aqueous smuggie. <laughs> I can't believe he did that. I just came over to say hello. What would make a guy do with that? Here, breathe from me. Take life from me. Please. Oh well, look, they're standing four abreast. Oh, right. please. I'm sorry. <coughs> oh, we'll just stand here because they're men and we're not. We don't want to. Take him to the other boat! It's closer! If it's so close, why can't we see it in this shot? We don't want to be involved. Gee, what a wimp. Can't even take a seasoned diver with a knife. Boy. I'm afraid you boys will find only evil here. I had him, Jolly. I'm telling you, I could have killed him. Well, well, he took my no thumb, move, Jolly. Nah, no, it's does it. What happened? Well, I'm not well sure. I started in theater, yeah. moved on to Summerstock, and now board. I'm in this film. Why? He held a gun on me, and he took my wallet, and I tried to stop him, and we scuffled, and he... Went overboard. Hmm. He didn't have any wallet when I saw him. It was eel skin. Happy now, Alcoon boy. Really matter. You see, there was nothing of importance in the wallet. You see, because I'm you lying my socks off. No, never. Where'd he come from? Probably swam uh, out from shore, I guess. Ah, sure. Yeah, that's it. That's right. Yeah, sure. Hmm. I'm kind of skeptical. Hey. It's like an awful long ways to swim just for a few dollars. Yeah. The last time I saw him, he was heading out to sea. How would you know? You were well, drowning. Well, it doesn't really matter. It's all over now, and I'm very grateful this young man didn't get hurt. Come on, Tiger. We'd better... Don't call me that here, now. Bunny. Please. Uh, tanks. Jesus. I Ooh. tried to. You shouldn't have brought the real one out here. He knows. You just struck out. Larry, will you please settle down? Get married, have he some kids, and take that stuff. ridiculous hat off. I'm more concerned with the problem at hand. We've got to get that case back before Lacopolis sends his divers back for it. Now, I know the scroll case is watertight, mm -hmm. but if we lose it, we really strike out. <laughs> Think that's funny, huh? Shoot yourself in the leg. I'll be right back. All done throwing up, Spunky? Don't worry, a girl. I didn't know you cared. I don't. We're going to get a bigger boat, right? Yacht party date on such short notice. Yacht party? You're really nowhere. Haven't you ever heard of one? 
Is it anything like a rattlesnake hunt? What the heck does that mean? I thought you were getting an education yeah, we got a split. in Arizona. Yeah, well, kids just beat me up a lot when I was a kid. Really? They lack yeah. the one thing in ocean. Oh. You do have a lot to learn. They swing. Really swing. <laughs> creepy girl. Oh, creepy girl, little creepy girl. <laughs> Jeez, what's wrong, Tom Silver? You look as upset and downtrodden as a little robot with inarticulate limbs can look. Oh, it's creepy girl, Joel. I just met a girl named Creepy Girl, and suddenly I find... I <laughs> smell a song coming on. <laughs> oh, creepy girl. Lyle Wagner's a total jerk, second only to Tommy Kirk. Could you find it in your heart to love a bot like me? That fishy story you tell always makes me sleepy. But that's just what I get for dating a girl that's creepy, my creepy girl. Oh, C is for that feeling of uncertainty for not quite knowing what ethnic group you're from. R is for the gifts you give me every time you smile. The first E is for, uh, well, I don't really know, but the second E is really a grammatical thing, because otherwise it would be creppy girl, and where would that leave us? The P is definitely not platonic, and why? Because I love you, my creepy girl. Oh, what are you, creepy girl? Are you French, Italian, or one of those swarthy gypsy types? <laughs> well, your accent suggests a romance language, but I can't be sure. Oh, we can definitely rule out a Germanic language, but it's okay. I'm a bot without a country. All I know is that I love you. I want to shout it from the mountaintops. Uh, but I'd have to get back down to Earth and actually climb a mountain. Or they could just drop me off on a mountain. I don't care. That would be okay, because I just need you, my... Creepy girl, won't you be mine? I'll give you scrolls and fish and tinker toys and wine. I'll ditch these guys if you'll be my creepy girl. Be mine before movie signs. Got a Rorschach swimsuit. What do you see mm. in it, girl? I see the creepy girl. Oh. I see cookie pants. <laughs> I see trouble. Come on and do the dork. Hey, nice little boat they landed there. They killed it. They roasted it later. Buddy, get down. Oh, 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 hot, oh, pure, oh, hot, oh, still nails, hot wood oh, nails. Oh, 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 This is the movie that, one of the movies that shaped middle America's sexuality. Deformed. Yeah. Yeah. Deformed, yeah. I could say something else, but I won't. It's cold out there. This is the place. Hell. Oh, they call this a mirage. They call it drug-inducing hysteria. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Nice. Yeah, that guy must have something. Yeah, he doesn't yeah. shop at members Our only date. or wards. Well, when in Rome. Yeah. Or Athens. What does that mean? I don't know. Hi, Polly! It's been a long, cold winter, Charlie. What does that mean? Uh, yeah. Get over there. I need some more chicks. What'd you say your name was? Yeah, I'm casting Caligula this summer, so <laughs> come on this down. This film was funded by the Utah Film Board. <laughs> Hey, she's got a shaggy diaper that leaks. <laughs> Get it away from me. Hey, it's Ed Bagley Jr. Hey, Kiba. Hey, hey she lost the bone in her neck. Look at that flopping around like that. <laughs> Come on. Keep them coming. Monkey love pile on me. Yeah. That must be what they mean by five easy pieces. <laughs> oh, please. It looks like the cast of Zoom. Come on and zoom, zoom, zoom on, zoom. Come on and zoom, hey. Zoom on, zoom. Nice tablecloth there, huh? 
Yeah. Very practical. Ooh, 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 Oh boy. Uh, Joe, was this before yeah. cocoa butter? Yeah, I think so. Shirts by the Renaissance Festival and King John, who invites you to come down and see Robin Hood and Little John, two Never Was actors performing bad skits. And bad music. These guys are horrible. I'm going to quit this band and start a career in music. Couple of cheese eaters there, yeah. Oh, please. Bee Gees go bad. Oh, er. Worse. And I haven't learned the words to say. Hey, look, I'm 60. <laughs> <laughs> I'm still rocking. Watch yeah. me. Tune in, turn on, throw up. Ugh. Now I know why drugs were so big in the 60s. <laughs> you need them. I won't pretend, pretend to, to sing. sing. To sing. To sing. To sing. While the girls prance around in their BBDs. <laughs> what do you think? Um, yeah. It's pretty bad. You know, lyrics by Aldous Huxley. Yep. <laughs> and most of these lyrics are in English. I think they sent the wrong people to Nam. Yep. You know, could somebody do us a favor and push that guy's amp in the water, maybe? We can't see. Can't see. There's a concept, it's called harmony. Oh, oh, look at those stupid legs. They're stupid looking. They're not real looking at all. Look like puppets. Huh? <clears throat> Vig Heil. Hey, anybody who wants, let's split to the beach for volleyball. Oh, yeah, go you go ahead. That's okay. Hey, looking up. Look, we're picking up the sports channel. <laughs> Darn, and I forgot my shins. Well, the other kids hate me. Yeah. One out of twelve. See the man whose shins were stolen. Should have been on board the scuba party. You missed all the action. I heard what happened. I wanted to say thanks for helping Dad. I had to see the man. See the man, Corner Wilmot and Carly. That doesn't matter. I appreciate what you did. Yeah. I'll let you use my shins. Thanks. Deal. Okay. Hey, what, what'd I do? Oh, Joel, it's her. Who's that? It's a creepy girl, Joel. Oh. <laughs> Finally, a sultry woman with a nice body. It's about time. Yeah. Yeah. Woman in like that. Watch her you talk about it. Girl. It's my girl. Come on, follow the leader. No. No. He's none too happy. Dibs. I call dibs. She's mine. Back off, you clowns. Get out of here. I'll take you out. Let's try walking like her. Hey. Slow burn coming up. Are you coming, Don, or not? <laughs> Well, you'll do it nicely. Let's go have a little Marty Milner's. Remember what I said about the last man on Earth? Well, it's time. Are you unattached like I am? You mean from reality? Yes, why? You don't catch on very fast, do you? What do you mean? I'm afraid I'm not used to the speed. Oh, hmm. don't tell me you're a drag, too. No, There's just a, a drag queen. Out. Mardi Gras here. Think you can handle the beach party? I think it's worth a try. OK, let's go. Uh, what about him? You're not engaged. Hmm. Okay. Hmm. Loose morals, huh? I get it. Meanwhile, on ESPN. Everybody dicks a little guy. Uh, so the game's over, huh? Hey, 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 come back here. Hey, what's the matter with me, huh? 
Bad breath or something? Uh, I guess I'm kind of messed up after all. Nobody likes me. There she is. <gasps> what do you see, oh, Tom? Yeah. Is she okay? I'm going out to get her, Joel. Quick. <laughs> Tom, I get her. I got her. Oh, no. Well, both, actually. No. I'm all help. Gee, what a nice guy. Uh, excuse me, can I have my... Uh, where are you going? I'm sorry, uh, I'm going to need that back. Uh, excuse me, but don't go too far with that. It's my windbreaker. I paid five bucks for that at Ward's. Please. Oh, thank you, God. Hmm. He's kind of caught between a rock and a hard <coughs> place. Not yet. Done? Sorry. I didn't mean to embarrass you. <laughs> Isn't this movie enough? Well, this is no time to be delicate. It's a good thing you stayed behind. I was ready to sacrifice my modesty. Oh, <laughs> we'll get to you that, my found out my suit is not for swimming. <laughs> oh, Joel, I have a question. What yeah. happened to the Where treasure hunt part well, of the film? Well, the movie's only half over. Maybe we'll learn something about Still it. Still looking oh, for your little okay. fish? Oh, you remembered. Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah, your deep-seated psychosis, of course. We talked on the boat. That is, I should say I talked. But we never really met. I'm Katrina Cavelli. And I'm Cuckoo for Cocoa Pops. Nice to meet you, Doc. So you're here on an outpatient basis. I like that. Huh? Your friends certainly know how to enjoy themselves. They're a fun group. They sure know how to get their kicks. Why aren't you with them? Well, I don't know how to I get my to kicks. You again. Is that why you stay? Yeah, something like that. Like with my little fish, I was afraid I wasn't going to see you again. Huh. I'm glad I was wrong. Join us. Join the party and be the rules of the world. Place. How about it? Well, I'm kind of cooped down I'm about that little fish and everything. It's all hot and it hurts and stuff. His name is Angelo. Yeah, he's a Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtle. He has turtle. something very important to do. And he's probably looking for me right now. He told me to wait down at the oh, pier. Where? Where? Oh, he said something about take a long, short walk on a long pier? Or? Something like that. Hmm. It's a dysfunctional relationship. I'd like to thank you. I'd like to thank the producers and the directors, too. Has he been gone long? No, not very. Hmm. Don, <gasps> would you like to help me look for him? Sure. I'll help Which you. He I'll help you. Down this way. So, did you call Harry Callahan yet? I'll need three more expert divers by this time tomorrow. And two implants. What are we diving for? That's none of your business. Well, Mr. how do we know when we found it? You to dive, not to ask questions. You'd better get out of here. Uh, like this? Like that. Ah, uh, now I'm going to go polish my suit. <laughs> <laughs> there she is again. You sure he came down here? Yes. He said he had to meet a man on the beach. Oh, that means he has to go to the bathroom. It's a guy thing. Yeah. Well, I think I better go back and wait for him. Angela has such a bad temper. Hmm. Hmm. Angelo Dundee. Trina! You dig this, Angelo? We're going to be married. Not what I asked you. Do you dig him? I'm a thousand feet tall. Katrina! Oh. Why didn't you wait like I told you to? Oh, you were gone so long. You still should have waited. She was worried. And you keep out of this. Hey, call him, man. Oh, you man. look out of please. Let me take care of this. All right, but if you run any static, just yell. Just yell. Call for the turtle boy. Yeah. You were very rude, Angelo. You had no right to be on the beach with a stranger. <laughs> Angelo! Something is very wrong. Who is this man of pain? You've been doing nothing in those men you always with. Oh, he's from paid programming. This carabinet thing isn't going to last forever, you know. None of your you know. concern. I never should have brought you here in the first place. I should have brought Perhaps Vicki Lawrence. Right, Angelo. Hmm? Yeah. What is that? Let me settle this right here and now. All right, I'm all for it. Hey, but we ran. Hey! It's black. <laughs> hmm. 
Hmm. Okay, now Joel, how do we comment on this without getting into big trouble? Uh, you could use metaphor, maybe. Mm. Raspberry red. Mm. Lemon yellow. Mm -hmm. Read my mind. Choo choo cherry. I just saw your sister. Oh. <laughs> oh, I'm tired. Quick, get a pin down his throat. Trake him. He's tired from all that make out. Well, I don't even have an agent. I just saw the ad in the trade dailies, and here I am. Hey, clam bake. <laughs> Fade oh. out, Ben. Fade out? Who's minding the store? Jerry Lewis. The <laughs> Where'd you split to? Felt like cutting out for a while. Hmm. You're using a lot of jargon. What are they talking about? Oh. Hi, Bob. Hi, Hi net girl. You like this suit? Mm, yet. Wild. Don't you dare speak to me. Okay. Wow! It's her again! It's creepy girl! Oh, oh forget her. Oh, I can't. I just can't. Hi, lower life forms. Hello, Don. I've decided to accept your invitation. To the beheading? It's still open. Why is it? Sam? You've got to be the mother of all pigeons. Yeah, tell him to stop oh, messing up our statues. Don't mind him. He's got a language all his own. Yeah, he took Aren't a shell in now. Um... Hmm. Trina, this yeah, is this everybody. Miss January, everybody. this is everybody. This is this. Trina, that was real dandy sport. Hmm? I'm Charlie Mark. I collect custom showgirls. But you can forget about him. He's ready for a wheelchair. Hey, come on, I'm 17. Cut out the good-natured ribbing. Nobody will introduce us. Meet the daughter of Satan. I gotta change my drift net. <laughs> Did I say oh. something wrong? Where's Angelo? I don't know. I don't really care. Hmm. You guys are me? That and the man named Lacopolo. What about Locopolis? He'll thrash her from top to bottom us. Doing know. what? Diving, I think. That's about the only thing Andrew's ever done. Why? Could that be the diver you tangled with? I dare not tell them that they speak of my family. Guy. Who's Lucopolis? I'll close up his esophagus. Then you know of his reputation. I'm afraid we do. I wonder why Lucopolis needs a diver. I saw it on Ted Coppolis. <laughs> a baby's cry for help. Help! Help! My career is drowning. Hang on, I'm coming. Wait, I'll get my jack. No, I don't hear it. Oh. I'll stay here and protect the harem. Oh, he's so <laughs> funny in the act of tragedy. And then there was something horrible. Oh, there he goes. Hey, wait. He's got salvage rights. <laughs> now, was that you who cried? Keep your butt above water. That's good. Right. This is better than that tarpon I caught in Bimini. This is a keeper. I'm gonna get out my fillet knife. Ha ha ha! Surfing turf match. You betcha. Mm. Uh, oh, uh, um. oh, saved. By the stinky guy! Uh, she almost dies. <laughs> she almost uh, died. She's got water in her lungs. Brain damage. Uh. And that's for you, Mo and Larry. Spin his shins. That if she was drowning, they would have all gone in. Unite! 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 Unite. Unite. Crazy Unite. popper! Unite. Crazy Unite. popper! The slap happiest game ever. Hey, how do you get slapped? Get him, girls. He hit Buddy. This looks like a strange version of Lissa Strata. The wheels do foam, do whatever they do. The chicks are up in arms. They've left their fields and barns. They're marching on the farms because kids won't drink enough milk. I would. When you're a jet, you're a jet all the way. Hey, there ain't nothing like a day. I got some rain in the sand. Nothing looks like a day. Nothing looks. Oh, this must be on the way to the Greenwich Village Halloween party. Yep. I'm thinking. I hope I get it. I really hope I get it. For some unexplicable reason, a deep-seated call from nature causes these lemmings to follow each other off the edge of the high cliff. Man, I got a pole with a capital O. Woo-hoo! 
Is he a time traveler? And now Red in the silent spot. Red's a fisherman and... Uh-oh. Uh -oh. Uh -oh. Too small, I have to throw it back. She hit Big Jake. I feel a number coming on. Hey, we better do something but quit. Yeah, this is Hey, it's Gloria Esteban and the Catalina Deo 6 sound machina. Hey gang, maybe if you do this it'll be okay. Ready? Five, yeah. six, seven, eight. He's the pay he's the only professional dancer they hired, so they gotta use him. Cassie! Is that Danny Terrio? Yeah, he's the guy who taught John to revolt at a dance. Girls just can't resist the frolicking vibes of a hot guy. Neither can I. Body on him. <laughs> the girls begin to become aroused by the provocative gyrations of the shamed males of the village. That's a, yeah. you know, I still am having a hard time figuring out what this has to do with any scroll. I don't know. Oh, yeah. Hey, gang, let's gather around for the next scene. Hey, it's the same shot as before. I love that. Continuity <laughs> <laughs> gets it on this one. Wow, they're dancing for apartheid. That's yeah, to raise money for the National Front. It's the Keep Mandela in Prison dance. All right. They want to play Sun City, I guess. P.W. Bota, back in office. Ah, the clean smell of kids who know they rule the world. Grab that lace, will you? Oh. Too bad. Mm -hmm. Next time. I'm getting done. Oh, sounds like the tape's getting eaten here. Oops. Oh. Hmm. Eight uh, track. Um, you want to tie yeah. that up over there, yeah. Servo? I'm not trying to bite it there. My arms don't work. Darn. And her name is Sybil. And all her friends. All right, this is great. You know, now that she's so famous, it's fun to see these old clips. Huh? Yeah. <laughs> From these humble origins, she went on to obscurity. Yeah. Yeah, it is a way it should be. Boogie. <laughs> hey, they grew up to be Jim and Tammy Baker. Let's not have talent, let's do away with fun. Let's all be white, really white, white. snowy white. Hey, I checked out the book of love, love one time, and it was really hard to find in the library because there's not a lot of copies of it. There's just notes in the margins and the pages. Huh? Just watch the movie, okay? And we're all white, and we swing to the right. Hey! Oh, here comes oh, wow. Carmine Raguso again. Hey. Uh oh. Hiya, show. Hey, do the jerk. The idiot. The moron. The potato up the buff dance. The dick queen. Do the white male reality. The Donald Hollinger. Yeah. Do the that girl. Yee hoo. Hey. <laughs> it's just one big, sunny, fun-filled baton death march. Yeah. Don't rewrite anything. We never change. Why should we? We're on top of the world. White love. It's good, isn't it? Tell me it's good. Come on. It's some swinging. 
Why did the Titanic have to sink and this didn't? I already, you know what the difference is between the Titanic and this? What? Titanic had talent. Oh. <laughs> thank you, thank you. You've been a great crowd, Catalina. Tip your waitresses. Come on, everybody. Oh. oh boy. <laughs> oh, the old suitcase gag. The this is a classic. Suitcase and uh, huh? Oh, see, no. Oh. 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 And then, oh. 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 yes. That's oh. so funny. This guy makes the film for me. Yeah. He makes oh. a film for me too, but it's. Not this one, huh? No. <laughs> okay, let's can it. Platt's back now. A pasty film on the... <coughs> hmm. The youth of today spent like so many shell casings on the battlefield of love. Uh -huh. I'll remember. I'll do all the talking. And you do the interpretive dance. Good man. Well, good morning, everyone. It was. <laughs> I forgot. <laughs> Hi, Mr. Duval. Oh, what a lovely day for basking in the sun. What are you doing here, Dad? I just thought I'd take my morning constitution. Oh, here on the beach? At two in the afternoon. <laughs> <laughs> Can't fool you, can I, son? <laughs> no, but I've got a feeling you're going to try. Oh. Well, the truth of the matter is I'm here for a reason. Yeah. You see, I'd like to do something to put a little sing in the weekend for you. you. Might give you some pennies, yellow jackets, or goofballs. <laughs> what do you have in mind, Dad? How about a scuba diving party? Scuba parties are nothing new. How about uh, naked? Not the one I have. A nitrous oxide in the I tanks. want you and your friends aboard my yacht by 10 o'clock tomorrow morning. How does that sound? Wild. Yeah. And you'll be diving for lost treasures. Yeah. Items worth five dollars and up. We're and dumb. here is the grand prize. It's a stick of dynamite. You, you get to throw it at. Oh, it's an old map case. Now, for every one of I these you buy, you donate a penny items. to Jerry's care. And the diver who brings this up wins the grand prize and one hundred dollars. Wow, what I could do with a hundred dollars. Yeah, nothing wrong with her hundred dollars fix. <laughs> don't forget, on board by ten o'clock. Don't forget your plot device. Dad, I've got that funny feeling again. Take an aspirin, son. Take a whole pot. Okay. I'm with you so far. But I'll be watching you, Dad. Hmm. Good boy. He's not even my son, you know. He's Marty Milner's kid. <laughs> Well, the rest is up to them now. They don't come up with that scroll. You can bet what Coppola's divers will. Oh, flog no discrepulous. Well, there's no way that guy can make something you can out of that now, situation. No. Oh, it's just direct. I don't see it, Frank. He's a comic genius. I don't see him. <laughs> <laughs> Meanwhile, in Gotham's Harbor, the Exxon Valdez. They should be coming up soon. What, our lunch? For over an hour, and there's no case. Patience, Lawrence. Patience. Lawrence. Hey, everybody. I found a new script, and this one's funny. Well, there's, there's bobby pins down there and band-aids, and there's a lot of hair on the drain. Mm. What do they got? That we ain't got. Courage. Next divers. That's the third time they pop with this thing. You and our time's see running time out. fly. <laughs> Charlie Sheen in Navy Seals, a Galling Corpus production. Hey, it's us again. Arthur, I have a splendid idea. Why don't they all go down together for one final effort? Without tanks. Sound idea. Is that agreeable with everyone? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Very agreeable. Yeah. Thanks for mm -hmm. asking. Appreciate it. Mm -hmm. We are here to spoil everything. Over there. Hmm? They must be after the scroll. You see any other divers? Oh, uh, only no, you. We can't afford to guess. Let's huh? find out. Huh? What? Down here? Oh, okay. This should be great. Oh, this must be good. Huh? What? Look, it's Dino, Desi, and Billy. Hey, Sinatra got him a gig. At the bottom of the harbor. He must be tripping. I huh? think so. Entertain all those other guys at the bottom of the harbor. Yep. Well, a couple should have made his move by now. Yeah, well, 
I guess they figured we were just... Oh, I got sandwiches. <laughs> oh, wait. I got that pistol from the man from Glad. <laughs> I really know how to handle guys like that. How? Oh. You got me. Where is it? You're a very mm. sneaky man. Oh, I'm with you. I don't have time to fool around. Where's the scroll? Should we give him three guesses? I don't see why we should. Oh, don't make him Oh, we gotta split, guys. Oh, I can't watch here. this. Oh, they look tough. Yeah. Oh, man. Oh, I think it's his sarcasm sequencer. So I'm going to have to field strip you a little, buddy. Come hey, here. Hey, ow, hey, that hurt. Give me that hey, back. Hey, neat. Hey, I'd, I'd oh, like a oh, wing, please. The overlords are calling. Look sharp, you guys. Oh, hi, right, Joel. Uh, just thought you'd like to see what we got going on down here. I think you know everybody. This is Jerry, and that's Sylvia, and you know Joel and the bot, so let's get started. And Oh, Jerry, you haven't even touched your sandwich. It's good stuff. And Sylvia, coffee? Just all you want, free refills. <laughs> free refills. Anyway, oh, we're going to have a lot of fun, uh, so let's get started. We've got fun, easy-to-plan stuff here now. Now, Sylvia, back me up on You know what I'm talking about, this one. Are you with me on this? These guns that are stored underwater, this method with the baggie and the... It makes no sense. It's totally impractical. It's, it's just outmoded stuff. We have nothing to do. But this product that I'm giving you the opportunity to get in on here, it's a triple ply polycarbonate reinforced substrate. As a matter of fact, it's the uh, type of material used by the astronauts on It's About Time. It's very... Well, Fred, how's our new oh, venture Frank. going? Frank. Oh, whatever. Oh, well, it's... Uh, Don't mind me, I'm just going to sit in and observe. Okay. Go on with your presentation. Oh, okay, good. Uh, she gets some of that. I think we got some Wisconsin yeah. cheese log there. Uh, it's not the same thing with him. Okay, uh, we got... Uh, oh, this is uh, for... For storing uh, hand grenades, uh, this is perfect. It fits on, and we have the gel in it. It stores at three, and look, it fits p perfectly. Uh, <laughs> it's uh, okay, and we have the uh, this salad. It's fruit salad. Stays perfectly well. Never would. <laughs> oh well. Here, let me just just stick, put that there. And this is even better. Here, this. Will stay right on there. There's no thing <laughs> that up there with the thing, and we'll put the. Oh, maybe I should do a joke. You ever notice how the mole men with the thing and the coffee with the put the Frank? Huh? Frank? Frank huh? Why don't you? Uh... Just pack it all in here. It's uh, it's okay. Why don't we just start cleaning up? I, uh, I, uh, <laughs> give you points for your, your little party here, but, uh... You're gonna hurt me, aren't you? No, Frank, I give you a... You're gonna be mean to me! No, I'm not. Why do you pull away? You're gonna be mean. You're gonna hurt me, and it's gonna be humiliating. It's gonna hurt and stuff. Look, look, Frank, you, you've got a lot to learn about being a mad scientist, and, and, you know, I... I think I'll buy one of your melon ballers. I... Well, actually, this some melon right up there. That'll be Frank! <laughs> Frank's going to be having a little pain. We'll be right back. Ah! Oh, my karate pinky. I got the implant. This will launch my empire. I know. King Dex, man. Oh, tell your friends, dude. Oh, black water, keep on rolling. Any resemblance to a real action sequence is purely coincidental. Once you get caught between the moon and New York uh, City. They, the case? Oh, yes. I saw them take it away from they the took my thumbs. They Oh no wait, they're still here. The other day. What's in that case? Whatever it was, it sure must have been worth a lot of bread. I knew you were up Toast. to something. I wanna know, what's it all about? Alfie. Fighting? I'd like an explanation too, Mr. Duval. 
I mean, this is the second time in the last few days that I almost got myself killed. Yeah, lots of other Maybe stuff, too. Maybe back to Avalon, son. I'll explain a little later. Will you put your hands down, Lawrence? No, I don't want to play well, patty cake. we really shouldn't feel too badly. The fates were against us. And it oh. cost us half a million bucks. Oh. Boy, the ball games I could have seen with that dough. Probably you know, I don't think I want to live in a world us. filled with adults oh, no anymore. Not a chance. Nothing's I right. You're hurting. Yeah, so that's what I'm afraid of. Hmm. Hmm. There's always a chance of the police tracing the stolen scroll back to my folks. Are you sure this is the real scroll? Hey, who's to say what's real and what's not real, apart. man? And besides, we heard Dad talking about it. We can Chase thank the screenwriter for that. More than a few hours. <laughs> the scroll we thought we were diving for was a phony. I just got a flash. A hot flash. When He's those going through find menopause. Up, they've got the wrong merchandise. Man, they're going to be out for blood. Man, everything's coming down on Let's me today. Let's load the hot potato on the fuzz. Cool it. Get the fuzz into this and his folks end up in jail. I can't use this lingo Bob's anymore. Bob's suspicious, yeah. especially as a copolis. He's Your totally psychopathic. So be my guest. I haven't got the blood to spare for those vultures. Got the hair for it. That's no good. The minute Dad gets it back, the temptation will be too much for him. And the four tops and the spinners. dollars is too much for him to turn down. For my bread, you should have left it where you threw it instead of going back to die for it. Please, later. I implore you, shut up. I have no right to say this. God, your hair but smells good. But I think I know good. a way to... Well, to scare the larceny out of your folks once and for all. Scare the what? And get Angelo and Foreman arrested. I'm ready to try anything as long as it doesn't involve mother and dad with the police. Or farm animals. We know they want the real scroll. What we've got to do is make sure that they know that we've got it. I'm not about to have them take out their frustrations on me. Oh, shut, shut up! up. Not about Charlie. I lose my image? What image? What's the play? Oh, uh, it's 12th night. We try and smoke out Angelo at Bourbon. 12th night? Bound to be around someplace. Let's find Tina and some of the kids. These kids today with their loud music and hula hoops, hey, fax machine, I don't know. know. For those of you following along in the Sidfield screenplay workbook, that last scene was the plot point setting up the third act. Now this. Mayberry, after hours. No shirt, no shoes, no script. <laughs> <laughs> okay, uh, hello mother, hello father, here I am at uh, Catalina. No, mm -hmm. it's not uh -uh. Right. Uh -uh. Zach Norman is Sammy and Chief Zabu. Hmm. Uh oh. It's the big guy. I have to sit like this since the implant. I'm watching you, Cran Head. Nothing. Here come the bunnies. Maybe they did better. Hopping down the bunny trail. Hey, it's Charlie Angels, plus a smart one. Nobody. <laughs> At least not anybody who looks like the two you follow on the Lyra. Hmm. Keep looking. Move out, troop. Well, it's McMillan and wife and Don, wife and wife. Can I talk to you a minute? What? Talk. Just a minute. We gotta go. What's wrong? Uh, I'm About pregnant. yesterday. I'm sorry I slapped you. And I wasn't really drowning either. Oh, yeah, and I'm I not acting. I forgot all about that. Really? Really? But you do pack a pretty uh, mean wallet. Don't rub it in. I was going to say for a pretty girl. Oh, but you're ugly. Listen, Charlie Moss has got a groovy sister. And you know who else thinks so? The football team? Ted. Well, I apologize to him, too. Oh. Only first. Oh. It's them! <gasps> Go find Charlie, quick. Right now. Mm. Hey, Charlie. I'll take him on. I know I can. I'll do it. Yeah. I will, I will, I will. Hmm. Lucky open table. Hmm. How come he got a menu already? Oh, peach daiquiri, so that's what I drank last night. Hmm. Tasted pretty good. Nice spit take, dude. I'm still waiting for my spinach omelet. And no slip up this time. Hi. Uh, yes, I am. Uh, you? I've been looking for you. 
Creepy girl. Don't make any heroic moves, my friend. It's too late I to rewrite the, the script. Hand it over. Angela, what are you doing here? Working, being evil? Friend, Shut I up. don't have time for games. <laughs> and I haven't got time for the pain. Angela! Man, everybody's coming down on it. Oh. Thank you. After him, team gang. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> now, oof. When you're a jet, you're a jet all the way. Splendid, son. It's a That's Catalina Ford Army knife. Always be prepared. And a feminine. We'll take care of the garbage. Go get him, Don. Can you handle this one, Mr. Duval? It's land oh, I'm sure I can. Some call them land pigs. You bunny stay here. See what he calls your master away. Hmm? What do you mean by that? Okay, people, everybody wear eye protection. There's a lot of loose ends flying together all at once here. Wow, this Main Street USA parade is really getting thin. <laughs> Hi, folks. That's not Mickey, that's Nicky. <laughs> hey, he's running into the haunted mansion. Ooh. I'm your ghost host. Paper clip. Crab fall, anyone? Crab <laughs> fall, I got them all. Ouch, 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 No exit through there. Hmm. All right, come on, come on! Yeah. Nice day. Oh, oh ladies. Oh, they go with the skate plane in the field. Of well, Ham. 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 Don't snag on me, don't snag on me. Eat it, boy, eat it. Oh, no. No. No, Jared. Jared, no. You got me all wet, boy. Well, I guess he's swimming back to Greece. A little late, aren't you, buddy? Take a rest, friend. You've provided enough comic relief. Thank you, Corky the Water Clown, for making us laugh at love. Again. What do you think you're doing? I've got you this time, Duval. Will you take these silly things off my wrist? I'm the silly thing. It's a thing. long time for you to make a slip. Nah. Now I've got you. What's this all about? Who are you? Fingers O'Toole, insurance FBI, investigator. FBI, Craft Division. My prisoner. And what's the charge? Grand theft. And wearing an ascot. Look, you don't even know what you're talking about. You stole the scroll from the collection, and it's in that case you're holding. Oh, wow, he's Give me holding, the case. dude. Hey, cool, a Bon Jovi poster. It's kind of like a pea shooter, isn't it? Mm, good one. It's oh, gone. Baseball hmm? My career. It was in there. I know it was in there. Why me? Why me all the time? Where did it go? Uh. I don't believe it. I'm Iggy Pop. Oh, boy. Hey, the script's in Braille now. He looks about 40. Closing time, young fellow. The guy who lives Thanks. here wants to go to bed. Sure is beautiful. Yes, yeah, sure is. Man, I sure love that old snot rag of a... Huh? huh? So, uh, you know, win them all. The pain, the pain. I lose a rich one, gain another. Oh, oh, stealing art. Lose one. Famous American cliche. Shaving my head. I told you it would be a long walk. Didn't I tell you that? Enjoy. Oh, you promiscuous, manling robot monster. Kill him. Kill him. Hmm, musical newspaper from Japan. And look. Zach Norman is Sammy and Chief Sabu. It says right there. Oh, oh, wow. oh, yikes. Uh, uh, let's quit. I'm hemorrhaging. Hey, Mom, Dad, you got any rhythm left? We're oh, out. How did it get out of my case? Back into the museum. Go That's figure. Charles would say, don't knock it, Dad. Perhaps it's best forgotten anyway. Acopolis has sailed away forever. Perhaps a little bit wiser for his experience. I doubt it. There's only one answer, Ann. Somebody up there likes it. No, dear. I think someone loves her. Well, it's not me. Well, what now? 
What's left for us? Not Drug one running? single prospect on the entire island. Prostitution? I've searched high and low. The pigeons have all flown Slum away. Lords? Well, you could always go to work. Yes. Yeah. Work? Oh. As Charles might say, that's a boss idea. You know, it's time I did some retiring. <laughs> well, there's that Louis Nye look-alike contest. Good dance, Goofy. No, oh, I've outgrown this pratfall stuff. It was just a phase. Now I'm a swinging cat. Yeah. Hey, it's a skinhead. Get Geraldo. <laughs> Say. Oh, look at creepy girl. Doesn't she look great in a, in a hairdo like that? Yeah. I like her in a flip. Oh, he's down to one girl, huh? He's cutting back. Oh, nobody wants to dance with the big, uh, stinky guy. Yeah. Shirt's louder than the music, isn't yeah. it? Dork Shack. Geek Dork Shack, Shack baby. baby. Yeah. That's where it's at. Got a movie that's as long as a whale. It's about to set sail. Woo. A plot hole that's as big as a whale. Huzzah! King John invites you to the Rem Festival. Come see 300 years crammed into one place. Meet the people you snagged on in high school. Bring your own tights or wear some of our own. Uh, principals to the front, please. Extras in back. Th there yeah. you go. Thank you. It's oh, a Krishna bag. It was only a movie. What? Oh, it wasn't movie. real? Well, it was uh, real, too. Uh, wait, I'm, I'm having some trouble here. I was right in the middle of that. Brother. So, a I, good movie des deserves a good encore of the cast. I wonder if we're going to see the fish again here at the end. What fish? Oh, that's right. Fish the, from the beginning? Yeah. Or? And the scroll? Yeah. That was good. I still don't really get what happened. Um, well, I, we got to do something to understand this. Don't this was just bizarre. Ever, ever, ever. I, I've been doing a lot of foreign films with a lot of subtitles. Where did the scroll go to, and how did it get back where it was? It was a lot easier to. This is harder than a Werner Herzog film to figure out. <laughs> I think it's important that we experienced it together, don't you? And we shared. Yeah, we better get out of here. Let's go. AMF vomit. Carry me. Oh, that's that's no. voice. Ca please. Come on. confusing movie, wasn't it? <laughs> well, no, um, not really. I only have one question, actually. Well, what's that, girl? Yeah. What the Sam Hill was going on? Yeah. Well, which, which part of the movie did you have a hard time with? Uh, well, I was doing okay until the opening credits ended, and then I thought it was like a cartoon with really good animation. You know, I'm confused, too. The only thing that made any sense to me was that darling creepy girl. I can't seem to get her out of my mind. <laughs> Ah, uh, Tom, Tom, stop the music, Cambot, cut it out. Oh, sorry. Uh, very good, Mr. Tommy Servo tune there. Uh, I had a feeling this was going to happen with this. So on the way uh, back from the theater on the spiral on down, will you move over, you guys? Excuse me. I took the liberty of making this uh, chart of the film, OK, so we could figure it out a lot better. Ooh. Yeah, great. Thank you. You spinach chins. Anyway, this is going to make us all feel better. So okay. let me just start explaining it, and we can help each other. OK, act one, uh, the uh, Alan Sherman wannabe in the Crayola hat, that's this guy down here, uh, steals the scroll from Pegboard Mansion. OK, uh, Tom? Uh, oh, oh, and he hands it off to the Louis Nye guy, the Billy DeWolf wannabe with the Jim Backus mouth, and the upgrade wife aboard the thinnest ship in the Navy. Oh, uh, uh, I remember now. Upgrade wife drew a fake of it, which they planned to pawn off on uh, Mr. Vanopolis. Yeah. Uh, okay, slam dance Cosmopolis. Uh, do the worm Acropolis. Would you two stop us? Okay, now, <laughs> then. Uh, Lockjaw, uh, Jim Backus, and uh, Crayola Head here get in a big plastic hassle with Lyle Wagner, and the uh, script or the scroll ends up going south. Oh, hold, hold, hold on, Joel, you're getting way ahead of yourself. What about Tommy Kirk meeting the creepy girl on the boat and the sensitive soliloquy about the little fishy? Uh, well, well, wait a minute, wait a minute. Uh, you're both forgetting uh, to mention that all the singing and dancing with little Richard tripped up on goofballs. Okay. And well, what the, the, what the heck did that have to do with it. anything? The entire plot was hinged on the relationship between the creepy girl and Tommy Kirk. No. 
No, yeah. listen, the whole emotional thrust of the second act was when Lockjaw throws the hullabaloo come treasure hunt to get the scroll back no, in his no, possession. No, no, wait about, well, what mm -hmm. about the dysfunctional relationship that the kid who looked like Jim Baker, you know, come on, uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. shared with Billy DeWolf and Jane Bennett? I thought that was the emotional center of the film. If so anybody about, Crow, that was the emotional Tootsie center of the film. Uh, oh, 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 Man, I'm oh, teed no off. Fair. I'm gonna go get the letters. Uh, Joel, 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 the letter's right here on the desk. Shame okay, okay. All right. Read that letter, okay. will you? Just try to calm down. Come on now. Okay. Oh, this is this is great. I'm sorry I got kind of crazy there, but uh, so my. okay. This is a really neat letter. Now, let's put it up on the screen there, Cambot. It oh. says, "Dear Joel, Tom Servo, Gypsy Cambot, and of course Crow. Yeah. We think you. This may be a first for your show. We met, we spent time together, and fell in love watching MST 3000, and now we're getting oh. married. Oh, oh, that's we're wonderful. We're hoping you can make it to the nuptial festivities, but if the si evil scientists won't let you guys out, please send a picture of Crow for us to keep hey, and cherish fabulous. as a precious reminder. Oh. Tell Crow the door is jar. Okay. Oh, and thanks. here, put this up, Cam. Out here's the wedding announcement. We're gonna have to block out some of this so like we names. don't get a bunch of misties there. Yeah. But um, <laughs> but anyway, but it's I the thought Trumps that. And it's that, in New York. Yeah. Is it an open bar? I think that was super cute, cool, and really romantic. Yeah. Yeah, isn't romance wonderful? Yeah. Hit it, Cambot! Ooh, ooh, creepy girl, oh creepy girl, my eyes pour out to you in heaves and droves of iridescent shapes and stars through the sky, but I don't care, creepy girl. I got hit in the head with a crowbar and I just don't see straight anymore. All I know is I love you. Bad movie. Uh, good fruit salad. Uh, push the button, Martha Stewart. <laughs>